Hey, welcome back to LS Take. It's your boy Lucky, and today we're going to be checking out another product from Lincoln. This is their power bank. This is one of their 10,000 milliamp power bank. This one reaches for $40. I want to give them a big shout out for sending this out for me to review. But yeah, let's begin with the video. Thank you for watching LS Take. Make sure you leave a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button, enable notification with the little bell icon so you don't miss out any of my latest videos. So Lincoln actually makes two different products from power banks to car chargers to wall outlets and charging cables. But today we'll be checking out the 10,000 milliamp power bank. This one reaches for $30. I'll leave a link in the description if you want to check it out. Oh yeah, this is the packaging itself. So we've got the branding there, Lincoln. Got a picture of the product itself. You can see that through here. And we do have quick charge 3.0 which is really amazing and it has 18 watts of fast charging in and out so for charging the power bank itself you can do that at 18 watts and you can charge devices at 18 watts which is really amazing you can see we do have usb-c power delivery qualcomm 3.0 strong and compact 18 watts of max charging on the back we've just got more of the specs and details of what it can charge different outputs yeah, let's just open this up. Yes, I need to be getting a new unboxing knife. I can't find one. I've been using a scissors for quite a while now, but I'll probably get one soon. Oh, ooh. That is, ooh, that feels really nice in the hand. A fully metal body here. And I like the red accent, so. Let's just have a look. So we've got the branding there. We've got four indicating light there to show the charge. So if I press the power button here, we can see we are halfway through the charging. So that's really good. On the back, we have a type A out. And then on the front, we have a type C in and out. So you're gonna be using the type C to charge the power bank. But for charging out, you can charge two devices and both at 18 watts of charging, which is really nice. And you do have this red accents on both sides, it looks Looks really nice, I have to say. But yeah, let's test it out. Lincoln actually makes cables as well, so you can pick them up for $10 each and you get two cables included. So you get a 3.3 feet cable and you get 6.6 .6 feet cable, which is really nice. And they come in two different colors. So you've got the black one here. You also have this red one here and they both are like color match to the product, which is really nice touch of them. So let's try the black one here. Just open that up. Mm, and you do get a cable tie included as well, which I really dig. And these are the ones you can just attach like this, like, and then it will just stay like that. It's nice. But this is the short one, 3.3 feet cable, and this one is a USB 3.1 gen. So you're going to get up to 5 gigs of transfer speed. So if you're going to be transferring something with this cable, make sure you use the short one where the long one is a standard 2.0. So you want to get like 480 megabits of transfer speed. So use this long, small one if you're going to transfer anything. But we're not going to be doing that. We're just going to be charging. So let's plug this in and let's charge. So get my Xiaomi phone here. Let's plug it in. And that is charging. Really nice. Let's try another device as well. So let me get a, a port cable here. Plug that in the back side. That is still charging. So let me plug my iPhone in here. And that's charging as well. And now both phones are charging at the same time, which is really nice. So that is good. So 18 watts of charging, very nice. So you get that 18 watts of charging, which works really well. As you can see, I can charge both of the device at the same time, which is really good. And you get 10,000 milliamp of battery, so that is really good. And it's a very compact size, I have to say. Like, just the design-wise, I like it. The shape of it, and you've got this aluminium body, so you know it's going to be sturdy and strong. Like, most power banks at this price point, is always, like, some cheap ones with plastic bills. And they just like feels cheap but this one feels really nice and i love the color scheme with the red accent on both sides and with the matching cables like that is just something nice like attention to detail that's what matters but of course and of course if you picked up the iphone 12 pro you probably picked up one of the max safe chargers so we'll see if that works as well 
So I got my MagSafe cable here. Let's plug it into the USB-C port. Of course, you get 18 watts of charging, where this one only needs 15 watts of charging. So let's try that. And voila, that works. That is really nice. So if you're going to be carrying this around in your bag because you don't want to be plugging in cables, this will do the job and that works. So that's a good thing. So that works. You can charge the devices. Of course, you can charge like iPads, gaming controllers, your headset, like whatever you want to be charging on the go. It's nice and 10,000, you know, you can be charging a few times depending on the device or what product you're going to be charging. But for the price, I'm really happy with And for $30, it seems really good. And for $10 more, you can always pick up the cable bundle. So you got some USB-C cables. If you want to be charging like your phone or your Nintendo Switch on the go, you can use those USB-C for charging. And at 18 watts, you should be getting really good speed of charging as well. And in case you need to transfer something, you do get that five gig transfer speed on the small cable, which is really nice. But I'm sure a lot of people don't use cables now to transfer, it's just iCloud or just cloud service. But in case you want to go to school, you do have that five gig transfer speed on the small cable. And for all, I'm really happy with it. Of course, I'm gonna have a link in the description for the product from this in UK, Germany, as well as USA. So do check out the links in the description. But as always, thanks for watching the video. Make sure you subscribe, leave a like. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care.